As construction crews work to bring the iconic 6th Street Viaduct back to life, Julie Allen works to make sure the project stays true to the design plan. So I ensure that the project is built in accordance with the design and we're, uh, we leave the city with a beautiful new viaduct when the project is complete. Allen is program manager on what's become the largest bridge project in Los Angeles history. What you can see going on behind me is that they, the contractor is building false work, which is a temporary bridge over the viaduct structure. What they're spanning over the railroad tracks so that they can construct the actual concrete bridge on top of the temporary bridge. Originally built in 1932, the 6th Street Viaduct connected the Arts District to Boyle Heights. But after decades of use, the viaduct started to crumble, and that prompted the city to demolish it in 2016 and begin construction on a more seismically sound structure. But will the pump be able to reach all the way over to this knuckle? It does, but it Since the $488 million replacement project started, Allen says the city has taken great strides to increase diversity on the design team. Um, when I started the project, I was the only woman on the team, and as we've been filling positions and I look for the best person to fill the position, it's been a woman in, in many cases, so a lot of our leadership roles on the project are filled by women. Allen graduated from UCLA with a degree in civil engineering. After 27 years with the city, she now helps recruit and mentor other women. She's a role model to me in a way because um, I see how she you know, carries herself as a female engineer in a male-dominated industry. And um, I just, I look up to her and I, you know, I learn a lot from her, just how she handles herself. Um, Julie has been a fantastic mentor, um, especially to me personally. I work very closely with her every single day and just the wealth of knowledge that she has and the leadership that she brings to the project from all her past projects, it's um, really empowering. The project has created hundreds of jobs and once it's complete, there will be a park here and more green space for this community. We're going to be installing 12 acres of new park space that spans all the way from uh, what you see over here on the north side of the bridge all the way to the 101 freeway. This is a very park poor community and the, the viaduct structure itself was very, very beloved to the community before and this new one is going to be an iconic structure not only for this neighborhood but for all of Los Angeles.